all right my people welcome back onto this channel thanks so much for subscribing to this channel our prayer has been that the good lord will continue to support you all in all your endeavors as you keep supporting this channel well we say a very big amen to that well my people this is another one reaching us right now hmm oh do one nation no going back and exactly what the people are still talking about well my people this is another one with the situation we have found ourselves in nigeria the majority of people hmm, are expressing shock on a daily basis majority of people are even finding it very difficult to sleep at night simply because hmm, they are like are you sure these people will not come tonight to kidnap are you sure these people will not come to attack and exactly why the Yoruba nation agitators are of the opinion that no going back all right my people on to this one chief sunday Bo actually gave a very sound warning to all the kings in Yoruba land most especially the king who is celebrating his birthday today hmm. and uh, he used the opportunity to give the king uh stand warning and then on to what he has said no majority of people actually reacted to that and then you know, many people i think most especially the urban nation agitators right now on this one they are like hmm chief sunday go tell them let them know i could hear somebody from the background he was saying jacob more <laughs> and then what was that thing else so chief sunday go actually you know gave a stern warning to all the kings most especially the kings that are given post that are given title to no, the so-called Fulani people who are not no entitled for any title in Yoruba land, and uh, he has no made himself clear. And I said, hmm, this is a warning to all the kings who are giving out no traditional title to these uh, foreigners in Yoruba land. That this is something that the people most especially himself and his followers will not tolerate that he is using this opportunity to tell them to desist from giving post to strangers in yoruba land and then you know, he has said it that as far as yoruba nation is concerned though that hey, hey, a lot of people who have been saying oh chief sunday Bowo has relented or chief sunday Bowo is no longer interested in you know, pursuing the Ujidua nation is said categorically in this video that oh, my brother don't let anybody deceive you me will be chief sunday but oh, hmm, now still yoruba nation oh, and then no going back now so it be all right and then my people know a lot of people you know have actually reacted though in different forms and the majority of you know the yoruba nation agitators are very happy with the situation with you know the information that chief sunday Bo had given to them you no know? and and then they are so happy that you sunday Bo, who is their leader has said that no going back and exactly what it is all right and then you know the yorubas are known for one thing according to you no know, the yoruba they say they value lives the yorubas value lives so no wonder you no know, it had been earlier said that if any soul or if the people, if the Yoruba people lost, if Paraventure eventually lost any soul, that is just like they have lost 50, that one soul is equal to 50 souls in Yoruba land, meaning the Yoruba people value lives. Hmm. And uh, I was so you know, impressed the day I heard of this, that no, we value life, one soul is equal to 50 in Yoruba land. So we don't tolerate no people tampering with our lives. That's why the people have seen it that hmm, if the Yoruba people continue to live in Nigeria, hmm, talking about one Nigeria that a lot of people have been talking about, a lot of no souls will waste. And you know, the people have said it that they can no longer tolerate, they cannot longer tolerate the government you know, maltreating the people. And the Chief Sunday Bobo came out that he is ready to put smiles in the faces of the people. And then I could remember vividly when you know, he started the agitation. He said as far as Southwest is concerned, as far as Yoruba land is concerned, that everybody 
his his brother that he will make sure he protects the lives of every individual because hmm, these people are not ready to let go and then we can never be slaves to them forever and they know in this video chisondi bo actually said a lot of things hmm, he spoke at length and then he talked you know to the kings that they should just calm down that if anybody believes that he sunday Igbo, has you no know, has relented or is not ready for the agitation say that means the person does not know what he's saying that is a pure lie because the agitation continues and it is no going back for the people all right my people and then no this had been what it is well meanwhile you know the election is very close you know some sort of people were asking me a question somebody just gave me you no know, one advice that why is it that uh, somebody like uh but i met you know book could not even come and uh, you know call the ilanomo dua the people together that oh you people should just try as much as possible and understand to vote for me then after then we'll just try to have you no know, to support the movement you know, a lot of questions have been thrown i've read a lot of comments that why is it that these people are not working together she people are met inubu na yoruba man why can't they support and then, if you ask me now who i go ask but one thing i have seen for sure is that as far as the you know agitation is concerned the no bother me to no movement i'm not sure it's ready to you no know, to succumb or to listen to the people and the yoruba nation agitators themselves they actually know what they want and that is why you can see they are still on the matter that no going back no matter what and then exactly what is going on look at what happened in in uh, our world church the last time up to now the you know we've heard a lot of rumors that the perpetrator the invaders had been kidnapped and they've been arrested so to say but <laughs> where are they where is the news where are they have they been actually you know arrested and then that's exactly what it is some people say that they've been arrested but they don't just want to disclose because the set of people who actually know about the movement <laughs> are the top people so you can imagine you living in a country and then you don't have no uh, security for your own life. You don't have a safety for yourself. And that's why the people are insisting that no, no going back because nobody will fight for us. And exactly what Chief Sunday will have said so far. All right, my people, this is what it is. On to this one, what more can we say? Meanwhile, let me have your own take on this one, my people. And remember to subscribe for more updates if you are new on this channel. All right, thanks and God bless.